Collinsville police arrest two Nashville teens in a stolen car and how they got the car, how they got it started. That might surprise you. Here's News 2's Andy Cordan. Hey there, Haley. You know the stolen car? It's a Hyundai Sonata. Now that's a vehicle that car thieves have long targeted because the vehicle has no anti-theft immobilizer. So all a thief needs is a USB cable. Kind of doubles like a key. Sunday morning. Got two occupants. They got hoods over their heads. An LPR camera hits on a stolen Hyundai out of Nashville. You can stand up. I'm going to have you walk back. Do you have any weapons? Nolansville police quickly make a felony stop on the teenagers who are wearing masks. Walk backwards towards my voice. Stop. On your knees. Lay down. Nolansville police don't find any weapons in the car. Keep walking. Keep walking. Go to your knees. But they do find a screwdriver and a stripped ignition system. Um, one of them had made mention that they knew the car was started with a device other than other than a key. To move the car out of the road, Sergeant Josh Combs shows the other officers how he says the teen stole the car using a USB cable that's hooked up to a cell phone, something that thieves have been watching on the internet for years. Suspect phone. Okay. Wow. Well, so that was interesting was you needed to move the vehicle out of the road. Correct. The vehicle was not running. Right. You did not have a key. No. But you did have their phone and a cord and a USB port and you started the car. Correct. They, now, now you know how it's done. Oh, yeah. Unfortunately, we've known how to do it for some time. So just so people don't get upset with me, thieves know how to utilize the Internet to steal Kias, don't they? It is. It is been well known how to do this unfortunately and so why are we still able to do this i don't know uh, that would be up to the auto manufacturers to change how they uh what construct would you... their cylinders yeah so how do you protect yourself well police say start by locking your doors in this case investigators say the bad guys didn't break any glass or pry open the doors send it back to you bob